and there are today people who are still actually anti-science. A whole movement called the anti-vaxxers who refuse to acknowledge the evidence that vaccinations have eradicated smallpox and who by their prejudices are actually endangering the very children they want to protect. And I totally reject this anti-scientific pessimism. I'm profoundly optimistic about the ability of new technology to serve as a liberator and to remake the world, to remake the world, to remake the world wondrously and benignly. Indeed, in countless respects, technology is already doing just that. Nanotechnology, I mentioned earlier, revolutionizing medicine by designing robot robots a fraction of the size of a red blood cell capable of swimming through our bodies, dispensing medicine and attacking malignant cells like some Star Wars armada. Neural interface technology, neural interface technology is producing a new generation of cochlear implants allowing the gift of hearing to people who would otherwise not be able to hear the voices of their own children. When I think of the great scientific revolutions of the past, print, the steam engine, aviation, the atomic age, I think of new tools that we acquired, but over which we, the human race, had the advantage, which we controlled. And that is not necessarily the case in the digital age. You may keep your secrets from your friends, from your parents, your children, your doctor, even your personal trainer. But it takes real effort to conceal your thoughts from Google, from Google, from Google. And if that is true today, in future, there may be nowhere to hide. In future, there may be nowhere to hide. Be nowhere to hide. Be nowhere to hide. Be nowhere to hide. Smart cities will pullulate with sensors, all joined together by the Internet of Things. Bollards communing invisibly with lampposts. Your mattress will monitor your nightmares. Your fridge will beep for more cheese. But this technology could also be used to keep every citizen under round-the-clock surveillance. A future Alexa will pretend to take orders. But this Alexa will be watching you, clucking her tongue and stamping her foot.